Hey guys, Sai is here and in this video, I'm going to talk about best nine Android apps, which is very useful. But before move on the process, if you are new on this channel, then don't forget to subscribe. Also join our Telegram channel where I provide important files and updates. So without any wasting of time, let's begin. Okay, let's talk about first application. The application name is Extinguish. So what is the use of this application? But before move on the talking about what is the use of this application? First of all, you need to set up Shizuku for using this Extinguish application. Note that how to set up Shizuku, I already made video on this topic. So simply watch that video. If you don't know how to set up, how to install, how to do all the process of Shizuku, then definitely watch my Shizuku video, okay? After that, you need to just come on this extinguish application, open it and set your floating controller, start this. Okay, first of all, you need to give permission from uh, Shizuku to uh, use this application. Okay, after giving permission to Shizuku, after that, enable this extinguish application. You can able to do work, any work with off screen. For example, I'm playing this video and after that i'm going to turn off my screen and uh, you see the magic how it's work so as you can see my screen is off but the sound is running on background i mean the youtube is running in background so this is the magic of this application okay so you can do anything like you can download anything you can uh, for example, if you are uh, uh, testing anything like CPU throttling testing, so you can do these all things in off screen with the help of this extinguish application. Okay, let's talk about the next application. Okay, so what is the next application? So talking about next application, the next application name is clever type. So simply open this clever type application so what is this clever type application so with the help of this clever type application you are able to uh, type uh, i mean let's talk about this i how it works so as we can see i open this application here it is the interface of this application so here it is this is a keyboard this is a keyboard which comes with ai support which comes with very additional extreme high tools so what is the um, that tools i will tell you just see this interface of keyboard so here it is the keyboard look like in a black theme so for example i'm going to talk uh, type something and you see what type of option is here it is present so as we can see on left side here it is the chat gpt option is present so simply click on that uh, chat gpt uh, button so you are able to see the whole information about what you what you type okay so this is the very useful application okay so my internet is not working properly that's why the result is not come i mean it is going to take very time so here it is you can able to change the uh, word tone like that uh, if you want to uh, write words in funny way like in different way so you can type that those words and after that just click on this button then you are able to uh, convert that uh, uh, words okay and talking about other functions so here it is a different type of function different type of uh, options also available like uh, translate option is also present in this keyboard a lot of features is present in this keyboard now let's talk about the next application which is floating assist so what is this application so this application very similar like uh, our uh, touch assistant option like uh, if you use a iphone then you know what is touch assistant option so what is the use of this touch assistant option you can take a shortcut uh, options with the help of this touch assistant as well as you can get a shortcut applications list for example this is touch assistant as we can as uh, we can see so here it is with the help of this touch assistant you can able to use a lot of features in shortcut way like that you can call it you can if you want to enable torch you can enable it turn off it you can lock it go back so a lot of features is present now talking about the second useful uh, feature so here it is a different uh, 
this is this option star option is present simply we need to click on it and as we can see here it is a shortcut apps is created so just click on it so you can able to use shortcut so this is also very useful so uh, if you want to customize according to your desired requirement then you can do able to do it for example if you want to add a different type of apps a bunch of apps you can add in one uh, this portion and a touch assistant option you can able to set a different type of options also present so this is the very useful application next talk about the next application it is a uh, gesture suit so what is this application so with the help of this application you are able to do that type of things which you want with the help of gestures for example if you uh, if you want to call anyone you can call it you, you you want to enable torch you enable it whatever you want to do with your phone you are able to do just you need to set a gesture according to your desired option requirement so for example uh, here it is uh, option is present so before move on this uh, app you need to i mean before um, uh, set the gestures you need to uh, give the all permission which uh, asked by this application a lot of permission you need to do it because this is a sensor based gesture based so you need to enable a lot of uh, features i mean a lot of options after enabling you can set here as we can see i set a calculator option for c option just c just click on this uh, uh, option gesture option and i am uh, as we can see i draw a gesture and here it is a uh, call is going so this type of uh, functions you can perform with the gesture suit now talking about the next application which is android clock widget so you can able to set a lot of widgets with the, this android clock widget so here it is just uh, hold on home screen and you need to set this uh, different type of um, clocks according to your requirement according to your um, taste okay so like i am set this clock and it looks very good a bunch of clock widgets is present on this application so you can able to set according to your uh, taste okay now talking about the next application this application name is tap translate screen so what is this tap translate screen so with the help of this tap translate screen you can you can able to translate with your screen options as well as you can able to uh, translate from one language to other language in the form of voice or you can type it so as we can see here it is i said in hindi and as uh, we can see it will take some time as we can see here it is did you eat your food so it will convert it into english like that you can able to translate your any language to one language to another language now let's talk about the next application which is tap scroll so what is this application so here it is this application is very useful let's talk about this application so first of all you need to enable this tap scroll okay so how it works let's talk about it uh, just click on gesture option and here it is a different type option is present single tap double tap long press so set according to your desired options for example i set scroll to top for single tap and scroll to down for double tap so let's talk about it and let's do it as we can see if i tap one time then it will going to down if i type double time then it will going to bottom tap once it going to top so like that you can able to set a different type of functions with the help of this tap scroll apk so here it is a very useful application okay so here it is you can set a different type of options i set long press for torch on so here it is a different type of options you can set with the help of this tap scroll very useful application now let's talk about the next application so here it is a different type of gestures so set according to your taste your requirement okay let's talk about the next application which is ios widgets so what is this application so you can able to set a different type ios uh, widgets with the help of this ios widget apk for example i am going to set this clock apk uh, sorry clock widget because it looks very good and i very like this uh, i mean i have much like this type of widgets which is similar like iphone because i am an iphone user so i like this type of widgets much 
so as you can see here it is a bunch of lot of widgets is present so you can able to set a lot of widgets you can customize it dark light as according to your desired taste desired requirement so this is very very useful application so as we can see here it is a different type of um, widgets is present some widgets are premium so you need to buy if you want to set that particular widgets but most of the widgets are free now talking about the next application okay so this is a launcher uh, this launcher name is dna launcher so this is also a very similar to a iphone like that this is a dna launcher so as we can see all the apps looks like uh, in style of ios and this ui this launcher is accurately near to near 90 percent is near to near like um, iphone options is present in this launcher it looks like accurately iphone here it is a different type of settings is present a different type a lot of bunch of features also present but most important thing is in this launcher you are uh, you uh, you can get a uh, app lock option uh, app hide option a lot of uh, features is present in this uh, launcher and most important thing we need no, we no need to do any root or we need not to do any shizuku setup for this application very simple application just we need to download from play store and install it set a default launcher and you can good to go to use this launcher what is the name of this launcher this launcher name is dna launcher and a lot of features is present in this launcher really very awesome launcher i think you need to try once very awesome launcher you can able to set app log you can hide apps whatever you want most of the features are present in this dna launcher okay so this is the best android apps which is very useful so if you like this video then please like and share this video okay and uh, if you're new on this channel then definitely subscribe this channel don't forget to subscribe because a lot of interesting videos i will give you okay so see you in the next video love you guys goodbye take care